Hey, what is going on there YouTube? This is Robert and today I am bringing to a video. I know, it's been a week or so. Uh, but yeah, today we are just going to be going through the sporadic release of the Palace Season Sale because they decide to be like, yep, here you go. Here's your end of season sale, and yeah, let's just run through it, see if there's anything we want to buy, and that's basically going to cover it. Obviously, there's going to be Supreme on Monday as well, so I'll be going through that as well, but they kind of go through like two or three sales in the end. They don't do a palace where it's nice and simple, so yeah. Uh, regardless, let me know down below whether you picked anything up from the sale, and yeah, obviously it's going to be later for US, I believe, so good luck for those who are going for that. Uh, if they do one in Japan as well tomorrow, good luck for those who are going for that as well, but yeah. Let's just get straight into this. Okay, so let's just jump straight into it. Obviously we can click shop, sale, and I need to move it down, don't I? There, so this is the sale. Uh, as you can see, it's it's a it's a big old sale. It is, it is a big old sale. That's one thing that I like about Palace when it comes to their like, season sales or end of season sales. They're just like, yep, yeah, here's everything. Good luck everyone. The other good thing is that Palace are quite open about like their sales. You know, I'm pretty sure Supreme are like a 20 to 50 or maybe even just like a 30% uh, off. Whereas Palace sometimes do like 50, maybe even more dependent on the item and they'll just be like, take it. So let's go through the first row where obviously uh, one has sold out, but we go from 578 to 347. So, you know, I like, 231 pounds off you know nothing crazy nice and easy uh we've got the downtown jacket we then have the gore-tex uh infinium loft jacket we have the uh pertex work down which obviously you can see what's sold out what isn't sold out and i'm just going to go through like that we then have the mountain parker uh yeah uh the relaxed insulated pertex jacket followed by the satin varsity which yet again it's like 60, 70 pounds off. Nothing crazy, obviously. Uh, the Gone Fishing jacket, the Formula uh, jacket as well. I have to scroll down because this is going to be great. We have the lowercase uh, hooded, well, hooded jacket. So, yeah. Uh, obviously, two colorways sold out in that. The purple yellow is still available. We've got the Polytech uh, Venter hooded jacket as well. Venter? Venter? I don't know. One of the two. Uh, but yeah, you can see what's sold out and what isn't. We then have the washed cotton hood jacket as well, followed by the panther uh, jacket. We've got the performance zip funnel. Uh, yep. The fleece bonded full zip mojito. Oh, is that the colorway? I was like, <laughs> what on earth is a mojito for like a jacket? Uh, but yeah, we then have the cardigans, which yet again are what, 100 and now 119 pounds isn't that then yeah anyway uh the space knit is up next followed by the cable patchwork knit that's actually quite nice uh anyway we've got the rodeo shirt coming up next it's sold out but i will take a look at it the flannel drop shoulder shirt is going to follow that we then have the check panel chambray shirt chambray I don't know, regardless, it's next. Uh, we then have the downtown shirt, followed by the hand stripe shirt, and then we have the scratchy uh, shirt, followed by the Domino Jackyard quarter zip polo crew, which obviously has three colorways. We then have the Intarsia font polo. That's decently cut down as well, geez. Especially in the navy, it's a really nice tone. But yeah, we have the Lurex polo. I was gonna read that as Lorax. Uh, polo is next though, we have the Gore-Tex, uh, Infinium Loft Jogger, followed by the Ducks uh, Baggies Jean, which obviously is sold out in one of the colorways. The Palace Over Trousers, the Deep, or is it just the colorway? Okay, the colorway is called the Deep Green. I'm getting so thrown off by these things, it's not even funny. Uh, yeah, so obviously one colorway have sold out in that. We have the Ripstop uh, Cargo BDU Pant, moving on to the Washed uh, Cotton Jogger which obviously is still in stock. We then have the Thermo Fleece Jogger as well, followed by the Panelled Shell Joggers. And yeah, there are a couple of colorways for them. The International Jogger, and then we can move on to the Cute Jogger, which is obviously sold out in one of the colorways. The Dragon Sweatpants is also sold out in a colorway, but it does have quite a few actually available. So yeah, we have the Slant Slip Slip. Zip Joggers. <laughs> We then have the dress sweatpant followed by the tactical uh, zip hood, which has sold out, so I can't. Can I check the, the 
price. No, why have they got it? Okay, it sold out unfortunately, so I can't check uh, what price it was reduced down to, sadly. We then have the Polytech uh, Highloft Hood. Sometimes that happens with Palace. I don't really get it. They put these pieces up and it's like, oh, Palace, thank you. And then you're like, hang on, those are sold out. So maybe I'm just a bit slow going on to it. So yeah, I'll probably be slow editing this as well. But anyway, we then have the cute zip uh, hood up next, followed by the zebra tie-dye or zebra tie-dye. Uh, we can then go on to the quarter zip cotton panel, followed by the big Ben hoodie, which is also sold out. <sighs> okay, we then have the spell out chenille hoodie. Okay, at least a colorway of that's in stock so we can see the retail. We then have the slant quarter zip hoodie. Uh, yep, that is followed by the pow pocket uh, slub hoodie which has a number of colorways. We then have the double popper P uh, hoodie. Yeah, again, number of colorways available, but obviously some sold out as well. We then have the Polytech laser outer half zip. Uh, yep, yeah. followed by the Palace established zip funnel. God, these are really getting long to go through, aren't they? We've then got the quarter zip funnel, uh, followed by the bag crew. It's just a crew neck. Is that a bag on your chest? When did they release that? <laughs> what? Okay. No, okay. Uh, we then have the Palace uh, Londinium Quilted Crew, uh, followed by the old crew. They're really reduced. Crew necks, £59 for a Palace crew neck. You've got to realise it's a really good price. Uh, we've got the Bun 5G crew coming up, uh, or just following that. We've got the sports mesh t-shirt. I might just open that to take a look at. The sports mesh uh, t-shirt again. The striped t-shirt. We've then got the slub stronger tee. A lot of the tees come down. Yeah, £35 for some of them is pretty decent to say the least. We've then got the Palace London followed by the light beer tee. Yet again, £28. Jeez. It's really, really cheap. Uh, we've got the from the beginning to the end tee. Yet again, £28. Solid. Uh, I've got the session T up next. Then we have the pets a key T, which there are a number of colorways. We've got the saddle up T following that. We've then got the chomper T following that as well, which has a number of them sold out. We've got the deflector boonie next, which is twenty nine pounds. We've got the mountain bucket hat following that. Then the denim bucket hat, uh, the M Tech shell running hat. Try cool mesh uh, runner as well, followed by the Palace New Era. We've got the script pow hat. We've got the ducker trucker or ducky trucker. I'll just call it ducker. Uh, the Gore-Tex plaid six panel is following that. The basically a Gore-Tex six panel. The Kevlar is reduced as well. Damn. Uh, the Varsity Chenille. I didn't like the look. Did I like the look of that? Was that the leather one? Might not have been, but regardless. Uh, we've got the lowercase six panel, uh, followed by the garment dyed uh, trifog patch six panel is coming after that. We've then got the Cordroy six panel, uh, followed by the P-Tech Cord six panel. The Polytech laser beanie is next, and the New Era uh, beanie follows that. We then have the P-Statue New Era, the Crochet Camo, the Mona Lisa beanie, the Fast beanie, which has clearly gone fast. Lowercase beanie is going to follow that. We then have the Panther beanie. The Palace Jeans uh, Cuff Beanie, the so far, yep, I guess, Waffle Beanie, and the last one is going to be the Triferg uh, Patch Beanie, and then we have the bags that are reduced as well. Oh my god, so much. Is there anything that I like out of it? I kind of like the look of this, but then again, I've got like three knits, and I don't really wear them that often. Oh, it's going to be sold out. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> the rodeo is obviously gone. That's quite cool to be honest. I don't know about the patches so much, but it is quite cool. And only extra large is in that. That's a bit annoying. I liked the blue. There's not really anything else that stands out for me. I mean, I've got a load of hats. If I wanted a palace hat, I would have wanted like a, a greyish tone, possibly. I would be saying. I'm not really a bucket hat boonie person. It's just I don't have it in me. So. <laughs> Uh, and as far as everything else is concerned, it's not really my sort of 
cup of tea to say the least. I did like this, but obviously it's sold out, so it's a bit of an L. Cardigan, I do actually quite like, but not for 179, even with the reduction. It's not mine. Definitely the white in this Scortex. Uh, whoever got that was smart, because that's really nice. But yeah, I mean, it's a massive reduction as well, and there's only medium left in the camo, so... The people who hold out and wait for the like season sale from it are really smart because you're saving yourself so much money. But yeah, I like that as well. Yeah, uh, but that is going to cover this. So as per norm, let me know down below what you picked up, whether or not this was useful for you or not, and whether it was just boring as hell to watch through because there's no like emotion when I'm reading things out like this. I'm just going through like an NPC. So yeah, that is going to cover it anyway. Uh, I'll obviously be covering the Supreme Season Sale and I need to start on things like sneaker reviews and other stuff like that. But yeah, uh, anyway, that is going to cover this video. So thank you for watching. I hope you have a good rest of your day and I will see you all next time. Peace.